We're in, a, in the middle or just starting phase of a three-phase project here. When it started, it, it took many different forms. What we wanted to be was the most technologically advanced, most efficient, most cost-effective container terminal in the United States. And I think we've achieved that. My name is Anthony Otto. I am the president of Long Beach Container Terminal. This whole terminal is all about automation. It's the first broad-scale, fully automated container terminal in the United States. What we've achieved here is a major paradigm shift in our industry, certainly here in Southern California or for within the United States. To be allowed to proceed with this project, we went through a very long, difficult EIR, an environmental impact study, uh, to make sure that the impact of this facility on the rest of the city, downtown, and the surrounding communities was kept to an absolute minimum. We're happy now to say that we are the first near zero emission container terminal in the United States. Right now behind me you see about 1 million TU worth of capacity which we went live on in April of 2016 and at full build out which is estimated to be first quarter of 2021 we will be at a full 3.3 million TU of design capacity. It's been a rocky road um, no doubt. Um, ten years ago it didn't look exactly like this, but over the twists and turns of going around the world to figure out the existing and the emerging technologies that are out there, the des best designs, and kind of putting all those together in what we believe is the next best design for a container terminal. But uh, it's been a fun ride. I think we've been able to get up to a stable place in which productivity has been improving month over month, which is all you can really ask for. I think it shows great signs of improvement as we go forward into 2017, and we expect great things. We have a union called the ILWU. We walked with them for years now, explaining to them what the technology was, its impact on their workforce. Our commitment to them was to bring them along to train them up in the new higher skilled jobs of tomorrow. And they've embraced that and they're doing very well. And anyone who works here now, the same guy who used to drive the crane out in the yard eight hours a day is now doing it from a remote console, sipping coffee and listening to uh, light music and air conditioning. ABB has been an, uh, an outstanding partner. They've been uh, involved in every part of this from the rail to the yard, to the automated stacking cranes, to the ship to shore cranes, everything in concert with Navis N4, which is our TOS, as well as the team's product for the AGVs. And ABB has been an incredible partner in just collaborating with those other two to make sure that all those pieces fit together and that this terminal operates really efficiently.